so after inserting your mavericks onto your usb as you can see i have already plugged my uh, usb onto the computer and this is the hackintosh that i am uh, doing the tutorial on so what you need to do is you have to now restart your computer just restart your computer and uh, you have to go into your bio settings these are the must options that you have to do for me it's your uh, left two uh, for going into the bio settings As you can see, I'm in my bio settings. Now, in your bio settings, do remember to disable the Intel processor graphics and also set your SATA mode to AHCI. If you have any problems, do write in the comment section. If you aren't able to get into your installer mode, I'll be uh, happily happy to help you. So, after this tool has been done, just save and exit setup. And uh, now you have to boot your uh, USB drive. So for me, it's F12 for the boot option to, to get. So as you can see, so I, I have, I ha I'm having the 8 GB scan disk cruiser plate. So I'll be just listing that and uh, just enter. For me, I have uh, already Hackintosh installed onto my computer. So for you guys, the it, uh, the Mavericks logo will be available. So just click on this, uh, press on enter. For some of you, if you are uh, if you are aren't able to get into your installer mode, just to use the bootleg uh, that I'm providing in the description for me. It's nothing, and uh, I'll be just uh, going into the installer mode with e the the boards and hackintosh that i'm using i I'm, I, I didn't face any problem uh, going into the installer mode so as you can see now the setup uh, i have to make the setup now just use your language language as uh, English now before installing your uh, OS OS 10 what you do is you have to go into your utilities option you go into this utility and I want to install the OS onto my 120 gigs or SSD so I'll be just listing it and I'll be erasing it to, to the Mac work X channel okay I'll be just uh, uh, listing as my name so remember to format it uh, under Mac OS Extended Journal. So just click on Erase. Erase. Now your data will be erased. So it's uh, now what you need to do is you have to exit and you have to click on Continue, Agree, and the OS that you want to install. As I have said, I am installing it on my 120 gigs SSD. Just highlight it. And click on install and you'll be seeing that Mac OS 10 Mavericks is getting installed onto my Hackintosh with ease so I'll be getting back to guys when this has been done as you can see the insertion has been uh, successful and your computer will restart itself automatically now again you have to go into your boot option as I'll be going right now by pressing the F12 button onto my keyboard and you have to again choose the scan disk cruiser blade and now what you do is as you can see i have my macintosh installed previous macintosh and the current that i have installed is sayed as you can see it's installed and uh, i'll be just going into it the first boot that you do the first uh, boot uh, the first boot that you need to do to your computer is through the USB disk and remember to install the multi list also and keep it onto your pen drive so that you can insert the drivers onto it so as you can see you are on your setup screen now and choose your country just continue continue um, continue skip agree agree
and click on continue don't register skip so as you can see now that your uh, mac os uh, uh, mavericks has been installed onto your uh, PC for me I think uh, uh, for me the, the internet is working and uh, also I'm just uh, switching on the sound to see if it's working or not uh, I've, the sound drivers aren't working so what you need to do now is that as I'll be showing right now the version is 10.9.1 and uh, it's GeForce GTX 640 so now what you need to do is again uh, you have to uh, download multi beast as I'll be going in to my 29 downloads and uh, I'll be just logging in. Uh, not now. Remember to install the multi piece uh, while you are installing it as a multi piece for the Mavericks. So click on it and uh, click on download. So it's getting installed right now. So as you can see, the multi piece has been downloaded, and uh, I'll be just going into the download files. And dragging the multi piece onto my desktop for easy access, just click on open and click on open. Now, here, uh, if you have a DSGT file, you can just uh, choose this option, or if you don't have a DSGT file, as I don't have a DSGT file, as it's DSGT free, so I'll be choosing this option. And for the drivers, for the uh, audio drivers I have ALC892 and uh, if you have your driver just uh, see the motherboard what drivers what uh, audio drivers does it use and for graphics it's uh, it's nothing it's Intel graphics patch for mixed configuration and uh, for network uh, for my network is coming and for system it's uh, done and uh, according to your system according to your uh, way of uh, handling the system the, the board you have to install the drivers as each and everything just check it out what drivers you have what you click on this build select the drive that you want to install click on install agree type in your password and as you can see the installation will be taking place so I'll be getting back to you guys when the installation takes place is over so while the insertion uh, process is occurring, as you can see, my audio drivers are back. So it's a very great thing now. Each and everything is working. My graphic card is being detected, and uh, also the display is being detected. And uh, the memory that I have, the Core Vengeance, uh, 44 gigs of RAM, it's also detecting my internet. I think it's uh, working or not. I don't think so. Yeah, it's working. So each and everything, it's it's working. It's great. You don't get a, your internet connection. Just go into your drivers and uh, install the Realtek uh, drivers, internet drivers. So I'll be just restarting my computer. Well, I don't need to restart my computer as my audio is there. Uh, internet is working. So through this simple and easy procedure, you can install your. Um, Mavericks onto any PC that is compatible for the Hackintosh. So, if you guys like my video, find my video, full, please do come and subscribe, hit the like button, and do follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Google Plus, and also do subscribe me for more iPhone or iPad or Apple related videos and also Mac Hackintosh related videos. Till then, I'll be seeing you in my next video.